Tell me what's changed in cosmetic dentistry over, say, the last five years. Only everything, from the way we design the smile, to the materials we use, to how we treat the gum tissue, which is truly the frame of the smile. Because if the frame is crooked, the smile doesn't look right either. Now you mentioned the materials, stronger and, and better now than, say, the last five years. And I would assume you're working in tandem with a lab. Oh my gosh, the materials are incredible. When I started out, we hesitated to do cosmetic care because mm -hmm. the materials just didn't enhance the smile. Today, the material systems that we have available are absolutely fabulous. But that doesn't happen without a lab partner. Mm -hmm. The laboratory is where the veneers are actually made. So we design them here, and through our artistic eyes, we communicate that to the laboratory but they have to receive those instructions and our design and understand how to create the beauty within the smile that we're asking for. So you're saying that the relationship between you and the lab is very strong, it's a lot critical. of communication. Bronwyn, you could take the best cosmetic dentist in the world and without a top quality lab, he's just average. And we have that. We have one of the premier labs in the country.